Hello viewers, welcome to my channel Picture Fan. Today we are going to learn how to make apocalypsis scene in Photoshop or how to create amazing cinematic scenes in Photoshop. So let's begin our tutorial. First we are going to take a new page or new document. So first we are going to click on file, select new. Then we are going to take a page. For example, I am going with wide 1920, height 1080 and make resolution 300 because this one is very important. Then press enter or click on create. So your document is ready. This one is your blank document. Now we are going to place some image to make our background. For example, first, first we are going to take this rock image or cliff image. And now we are going to placing this one in this, this area. So this one is placed perfectly. Now we are going to add more image to give amazing look in our background image. So we are going with this one. This one is also selected. I am select this one by using qu quick selection tool. You can also use this by using quick selection tool. Simply drag and drop this one and resize this one. And we are going to erase this one by using eraser tool. Zoom your brush or resi resize your brush by using bracket key and simply erase these lines. Now again take another image. So this one is my another image and I am already selected select this one by using quick selection tool. So simply drag and drop this one. and adjust your image per as your work so now this one is done and we are going to take a mask layer to remove this line so click on brush remember make soft brush and this one is make 24 percent this one is okay and remove this area Now this one is almost done. Click on this area, brush and make this time foreground color white. Resize your brush and apply this. And again make foreground color black and remove these lines. Make 100% and remove these lines. So this one is done. Now we are going to match the color of this clips and this one. So simply go to adjustment layer and select color balance and select clipping mask and increase yellow color and reveal red color. So we can say that the color is also match. Now we are going to place our model in this area. So where are where is our model? So this one is our model. I select this one by using pen tool and you can also use quick selection tool for make selection. So simply drag and drop this one and resize your model as per your work. So your model is placed. Your mountain rocks are already ready and now we are going to place and now we are going to place our background image so background this one is our background and simply drag and drop this one and zoom out your image by pressing ctrl minus and resize your background image apply this one and sit behind the rock Again zoom your image and this time make be careful to arrange your image so I think this one is look perfect
now we are fill this blank area so what we have to do just take rectangle marker to select this area and first we march first we first we crop the image just crop this one and now we are going to take rectangle marker to and select this area and go to edit select fill and select content aware then press ok so this one is selected now your work is almost done and deselect this one now we can see that the image looks perfect and it is it placed also perfect now we are going to add some dots to on or we are going to apply some dots to to give amazing bright look or white look so just take a new layer go to edit fill and make this one 50% gray then press ok then go to right click and select create clipping mask and go to overlay and select and go to blending mode and select overlay and now we are going to dots to zoom your image by pressing ctrl plus and simply apply this one make exposure a little bit higher and then apply this one So this one is done now we are going to add or we are going to apply a little bit smart tool use some smart tool on her hair apply this one little bit to provide amazing and original look on hair So this one is done and now we are going to match the complete color of this work. So first we are changing this to color by using match or uh, first we are going to match this layer. And go to field adjustment and select color balance and balancing the color of this work and also do the same thing So this one is almost done and make this background in duplicate and now we are going to use filter and select blower and go to gases blower make little bit blower background not so much and now we are going to adjustment layer and select color balance and now we are last we are going to balance in the color of this work make little bit shadow make 100% and apply this one and also apply this one The 
for shadow is also applied now we are going to add some extra images to provide amazing look so this one is bush image and simply drag and drop this one and resize this one and put behind the rock make duplicate this one and also provide a little bit in that portion so it's look real and it's look amazing place in that area so this one is almost done and we are going to add some extra effect such like this one The work is almost done now we are going to give our final touch so first we are going to mask the complete layer in one layer then first uh, we add little bit light on her face so what we have to do just simply take a blank layer go to brush tool and change the color of this one and resize the brush size Set this one in overlay. So this one is also done. Set this one overlay and apply this one. So this one is also done and now we are going to add our final touch. So just mask the complete layer in one layer. So hold shift control alt plus E. You can see that the work is done in one layer and make this one in complete one group. And click on group so you can see that the work is in group now make this one duplicate just for backup and go to filter camera raw and go to effects or effect post effect then increase the decrease the amount of light Highlight priority, increase little bit sharpness and go to split tone and select highlighted area yellow or orange little bit and make shadow area blue. Increase the saturation because color is very important. Little bit. Now then press OK. Again go to filter, select Nick Collection and Color FX Pro. Then select 20 L02 and 
increase the color of 33 percent is perfect and make shadow little bit higher then press ok now we are going to again fill adjustment layer and select this time gradient and select any of this color so this one is perfect then go to blend mode and select over soft, soft layer and increase decrease the opacity of this area make this one 50 percent so your work is done if you like this tutorial please subscribe my channel see you soon with new tutorial goodbye